Welcome everybody back to the brand new video and today um as you can see from the title of the video, I'm gonna be showing you around five tips and tricks to not get copyright claimed. Now for me personally, I just recently became a YouTube partner program. Uh well partner I guess and I haven't made ads yet or I haven't started making ads yet or getting ads yet, but you know Jiggle a snack up it and fuck with my nut on seas. Baby boy says so jig a line my jig or you eating some mango so mm. <laughs> Alright the first thing to do to prevent any copyright claims is well first thing first look at the charm. Now for instance Billie Eilish she has this little thing that means at the at the end of her name, which means that she's a verified YouTube artist, which means that she makes which which also means I know I know there's a lot of which means, but which also means that she probably has a copyright team. Which means and you don't want to use her music. Which means also uh, we're talking about that. If the music, right? If the music video has, just go to the description of the music, right? The music video, any music video uh, that is very interesting, and it may not even have the verified check mark thing, but just go check it at the description of the video and see if it says anything with copyright yes. or anything with. If you scroll down, you will see description, copyright owners from this to this, and if that doesn't appear, check all the way at the bottom. And if you see something that says music, right, and right beside it, it shows the music that you're listening to, Bruh. it just means that it's copyrighted and not. Yes. Music. Now I know some channels may say that oh yeah, copyright free music, get your here now. <clears throat> from I made nearly 400 videos on my YouTube channel. <clears throat> and from experience, some of these channels that say, oh yeah, copyright free videos, and they may in the, in the title say copyright free, but in reality, it's just copyright. So uh, later on in the video, I'm going to be explaining. Stop the cap. <laughs> Stop the cap right now. Stop the cap. On the fourth thing that you guys probably missed, and this is probably the most important one, and it is don't use unreleased songs. Now I know on by unreleased songs we mean like like Juice World or or like like I don't know just the Bieber or something like that, but it's called unreleased song, which technically means it will be released in maybe one day or one week or one year's time. Which means as soon as they actually fully release the official song, you will get a copyright claim. Go. Anita Max Wien. Anita Max Wien. The way to not get copyright claimed. I know this way might be a little bit lame because you don't have people like Taylor Swift. And uh, you know, like um, Taylor Swift or Roddy Rich, you don't have those famous rappers. But if you don't get copyright claimed, I would recommend using the YouTube's audio library. They have a whole section with non copyright songs. And to actually confirm that, if you actually do get a copyright claim, there's one way to actually prevent that, and that is by changing a song to the YouTube audio library. So, if you guys enjoyed this video, you know what to do kiss this little fishy. Like, subscribe with the post notifications on, and see you on the next one.